Hey, it's Tyler from ActiveBeat. Life can get busy, can't it? And when you've got a lot on your mind, it's hard to keep track of the simple things, especially when it comes to your health. That's why we want to break it down bit by bit and talk about the little things that slip by sometimes. Today, it's vitamin B. So what in the world is it? Well, vitamin B actually refers to something called the B-complex vitamins, a family of eight water-soluble vitamins. So we've got a lot to cover. Let's get into it. First off, we've got vitamin B1, thiamine. It releases energy from foods and keeps your appetite regular. You're going to get your thiamine from legumes, pork, cereal, and enriched foods like rice or pasta. Next, we've got vitamin B2, riboflavin. You might have heard of this one. Riboflavin is actually very important for healthy skin, good vision, and also releasing energy from foods. Milk, eggs, dark green veggies, and whole grain products are going to give you your vitamin B2. Moving on to B3, niacin. You need it for energy production, digestion, keeping a normal appetite, and healthy skin. Keep up with the fish, poultry, peanuts, and most meats in your diet and you should be good. Coming up is vitamin B6, and no, we didn't skip vitamin B4 and B5. There actually aren't any. B6 helps metabolize proteins and helps with blood cell formation. You also need this stuff to get your body to produce insulin and hemoglobin. Get your B6 with most meats, cereals, and leafy green veggies. Next, we have folic acid. You need folic acid to help metabolize protein and better enable red blood cell formation. You can get folic acid from dark green leafy veggies, fish, whole grains, and citrus fruits. Next up, we've got vitamin B12. It helps build genetic material and maintain your nervous system. You can get vitamin B12 from meats, fish, eggs, and milk products. Next up, we've got biotin. It helps you release energy from carbs and helps out with metabolism of proteins and fats from food. You get biotin from things like egg yolk, milk, and most fresh veggies. We round up our B-complex vitamin family with pantothenic acid, which is involved in energy production and helps the formation of hormones. You get pantothenic acid from egg yolks, meat, and legumes, among other things. And now you know what in the world vitamin B is. So, if you have a suggestion for a video for our What in the World series, let us know in the comments. We'd love to hear it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.